Hello there, welcome to Cartooning with Paul. Today, I'm gonna show you how to draw Rufus from Kim Possible. So come on, let's get started. Hello, cartooners, welcome back. Yeah, I've been getting requests on how to draw Rufus, the naked mole rat from Kim Possible. So let's dive right on in. <laughs> Vermin. Ball creepy. Oh, that ain't right. Oh, want some of this? Okay, so when drawing Rufus, let's start with an oval shape. You know, about this size on the paper. So now before I go any further with this, I have to kind of figure out how long to make the body. Now, before I do anything else, I gotta remember he's three heads tall, so I'm gonna figure out exactly where the floor goes. So here's uh, one head, there's two, and there's three. So there's the floor. That's where his feet will rest. And now I can kind of figure out exactly where everything goes. Here's the vertical axis, and here is the horizontal axis. Look at that curve I'm giving it up there. So he's kind of looking downward a little bit, and let's figure out this body. Um, let's see. Yeah, his, his line of action would go like that. So, um, let's see. Yeah, that's right. body will do this and then down here at the bottom I'm going to bring one leg back here for balance because he's got a got to stand so I'm gonna cap off his foot like this if I'm going too quickly, don't worry. I'm going to slow things down in a little bit here. But let's... Um, let's throw in... One leg there like that. Now he's got this leg back here like this. The front leg... I'm gonna have it kind of lunging forward just a little bit. Like so. Now you'll notice all of these lines are very swoopy, right? They're just kind of all kind of blending in to the to the shape. Alright. Um we've got a really, really awesome character designer in our world today. His name is Steven Silver. So he took the premise of the show, all of the notes and ideas from the creators of the show, and came up with this awesome character design. Yeah, let's see. I'm going to take an eye, put it up here. Another eye right here like this. Now they're ovals, and they're kind of tilted in a like a 45 degree angle from the center of the head let's give him his brow lines up like this so we're going to give it a v-shaped nose right in here i've reached out to steven silver's team and i got some really great model sheet work of kim possible and, oh, I adore it. I'm going to frame it and put it up in the studio. I loved this show when it came out. It came out around the time of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. So it was all, you know, girl power. And and she was speaking in a, in a way that just sounded hip and cool. And then under that, we're going to give a nice, big, wide smile. It was a really clever take on... On the like super spy type genre 
where Kim Possible led a... Well, actually, she didn't lead a double life, did she? Everybody knew. I'm just going to give some little laugh lines in the corners. She was the superhero, like a James Bond-type character. And he's got some serious, serious front teeth here. If you've ever taken a look at a real naked mole rat, they are some of the ugliest creatures on the planet. They usually spend all of their time burrowing in the dirt, so they've got these great big teeth to help them get through a lot of the tough spots that they're in. And now we're going to do something that I get requests for quite a bit. People like to see how, how you learn how to fold arms in front, right? He's crossing his arms, and we know how I do it here. We're going to throw in a box, right? So here's one arm here, there's another arm, and then they cross here. And then what I do is I take the upper arm and I just kind of figure out where it folds over the other. And then this side. And now we want to give him that drawing style. So we got a nice swoopy, like a J shape there like that. And it will come over like so. So here's the most upper, most forefront limb right here. We're gonna throw in his front claws Kind of like a curved pizza shape. A little pink right there, and then his claws, and I'm just gonna shade that in. Now, under here, we've gotta continue off of this line to give the top of the back arm. We wanna remember that it's gotta come off of that hand. Turn this a little bit, and, oh, that's good. Yeah, like that. Don't worry if this arm looks a little thicker than that, it's just part of the design here. Just to really push that he's crossing his arms. I'm just gonna make sure that this is all one shape here. And then back here, like that. And now the one thing that we have to add on before we throw our finishing touches on is his tail. So. Now the one last thing we need to throw in are his whiskers. He's got about four on each side. Now they come from right around here, which just throw in like that. And that is how you draw Rufus from Kim Possible. Guys, I hope you like this video. If you do, I've got other easier drawings on an easier drawing playlist right here for you. Check out to see what else you might want to draw with me. I want to thank you guys so much for drawing with me today. And until the next video, we'll see you later.